I'm Tom Gosey. This week on Hot and Cold, we're working on cars in the wintertime in Maine. This is my number two gizmo. My number one gizmo got sold, but you know, you always have to have a spare when it comes to gizmos. And uh, I just wanted to show you the business end of an electric car because I know you've been waiting to see the business end of an electric car, especially the gizmo. You were talking about it only on Hot and Cold, right? So this is the business end of an electric, at least a three-wheel electric car. And what we have, of course, is a drive wheel. This particular car uses a moped tire. Um, got a chain drive that goes to an electric motor that's right here. See, we got, this turns real fast. So we have a little sprocket here. We have a big one here. So that makes the wheel turn slower to go at the right speed and gives it a lot more torque. So it's more powerful. And if, if you're a guy like me, if you just happen to have a jumper cable sitting here and you happen to stop by and you say, Tom, what are you doing? I do this. I show you. <laughs> when you put the electric power to the electric motor, the electric car goes forward. Real simple stuff. This is why I love electric cars, because they're very simple like me. I'm a simple guy. <laughs> Great safety issue. If you ever work on an electric car, and you're doing this kind of stuff, you always have the electric car drive wheel up in the air. Because I have had the experience where something shorts out, something happens, it happens, Murphy's Law rules supreme, and you have things sort of semi-wired, and all of a sudden, this thing takes off across the room. It happened. <laughs> And it's not cool. Anyway, we're going to show you this as we get it put back together because this was a basket case when we got it. We actually have tires on it. It rolls around now. And you see stuff like this all the time on Hot and Cold right here on ABC7. Sunday mornings at 11.30 on Fox 22 at 8.30 on Sunday morning. And right now, I'm just going to make believe. Hmm. 